Tonight, standing room only as a developer looks to build a subdivision on a rural undeveloped lot. And within the last hour, the vote came striking down that plan. Ten of your size, Liz Kilmer, spent the evening at that meeting tonight live with how it impacts people in your county. Liz. Yeah, well, after hearing from dozens of citizens tonight, the Planning Commission voted 6 to 0 against rezoning a 114 acre rural lot. Now, had they voted in favor of. I don't think it's the right way to go. A passionate plea from York County residents not wanting this undeveloped lot on Yorktown Road to become this subdivision. This really doesn't fit in with the way things look around. Around that area. Yorktown Road will be inadequate to, con to contain the, tr the traffic brought on by this proposal. Concerns apparently heard by the Planning Commission, which ultimately voted unanimously against the Smith property lot being rezoned from rural residential to medium density. It was the request from Harrison and Lear. Their three phase construction plan would have also included new trails, turn lanes, sidewalks, and lights, and more than half a million dollars to the county each year. Some citizens supported it. There are really no other proposed developments in this end of the county. The county's principal planner agreed it was well designed, but deviated from the county's comprehensive plan, ultimately recommending the Planning Commission vote for denial. And they did vote unanimously against the rezoning. One commissioner did say, though, that this land will likely still be developed. Perhaps it will end up being a subdivision, but with less homes. That does remain to be seen. This matter now goes before the Board of Supervisors in May. I'm live in York County. Liz Kilmer, 10 on your side.